हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल सो आफ्टर अ लॉन्ग टाइम आई एम डूइंग दिस सिट डाउन इन्फॉर्मेटिव वीडियो लाइक लिटरली लॉन्ग टाइम इन बिटवीन टू वीक्स आई डिड नॉट पोस्ट एनी थिंग बिकॉज आई वॉज काइंड ऑफ लेजी एंड बिजी इन माई अदर वर्क एंड लेटर आई वेंट टू दैट स्टूट गार्ड एंड देन डिड लाइक स्टूट गार्ड ब्लॉग बट इट्स बीन अ लॉन्ग टाइम आई हैव एन डन दिस सिट डाउन इन्फॉर्मेटिव वीडियोज सो I am again here with some information that you should know. If you are applying for German universities, then um, you should know these websites for sure. These are all legit websites. You will come across these websites if you are planning to um, apply. We'll start step by step, like how the application process is: finding universities, then fulfilling their requirements, then later doing the. insurance thing visa thing and now aps thing so we we'll go step by step and then um you'll get to know uh just for the information all the links whatever i am going to talk about all the websites i am going to put link in the description so you can just go click on it save those uh, links for your future use okay so let's start with the very first website um firstly if you are planning to apply then you need to know the um universities right the courses universities so for that one website that is like the most important website is dad dot de which is the official german website like german government recommended website so you should definitely check dad dot de not just for the universities but also for the scholarships and research programs and other study related programs in germany for international students secondly um this is not like an official website but um this website i used personally when i was applying so it is called study portals for master and the third one is mygermanuniversities.com so this is also um not the official website but i personally used it so second thing that you have to do while applying is that you need to know that if your university where you already study like in india so if that university is um considered to be that level of university like the german level of university or not you have to go check in this uh, specific website called anabin so you have to go to anabin and see if your university has a h plus um grading that means that your university is um recognized in germany and then you can apply to the universities next is the uni assist that is important so most of the universities need a vpd which is actually um a certificate that shows that proves that your qualification is um german standard whatever qualification you have gained in india is recognized in germany as well and also um, most of the universities um ask you to actually get the vpd and apply through uni assist also so it is not like directly go and uh, apply to the university on their official website but you have to up, uh, apply through uni assist so a detailed information i won't go deeper into it because this like each and every topic it's like you can make a whole video out of it so i won't go deep inside the purpose of this video is just that you should know these websites because you can come across those websites and then you should know what it is about moving forward um if you are like you got the university now and then you have decided this 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 university you want to go and then every university needs one thing common is that you need to write a cv so recommended website is europass where you can write um european standard cvs steps stone can also help you in that okay so next important thing is that language certificates english language uh, certificates tofel and ielts coming to the german language certificate depending upon what type of german exam you are giving like testaf or um, dsh or tel or goethe institute certificates you have to go through that websites so while doing all these things you one thing you also need to know is cgpa you have to convert your indian cgpa into german gradings so for that you 
I don't have a specific link. You can just go on Google and search CGPA to German grade. You'll get different type of websites um, where you can just go and convert. It's easy. Now, one of the most important and uh, required document these days is APS certificate. For that, you have to go to the APS official website. The link i'm gonna give it in the description so yeah so moving forward with the health insurance so one of the important document that you need for visa and also studying and living in germany is that health insurance so for health insurance so there are different websites that i'm gonna tell you in few, a few minutes but um i would recommend that take um uh, health insurance with the blocked account service provider so blocked account is basically uh, an account where you keep some amount and uh, that amount is actually given to you monthly on a monthly basis or like at once uh, depending upon your service provider for your living exp uh, expenses um, for a year actually when you study in Germany so that is the money that you can use for your living expenses let's talk about the blocked account provider first and then the health insurance companies so blocked account providers there are different type of block blocked account providers but four are those uh, which are recommended so Coracal, Fintiba, Expatrio Deutsche Bank. Also Kotak Mahindra provides but it is not recommended to get it from Kotak Mahindra because there is like a lot of issues and also um, Kotak Mahindra actually gives the blocked account money all at once so it can be a bit difficult to uh, handle if you open the blocked account they give it all at once. So that is what I feel it's a drawback. Also it is a bit difficult to unlock here when you come here you have to unlock there is some unlock procedure that you have to follow to get your money so it is a bit of a struggle for Kotak Mahindra so it is not recommended my personal uh, I use Coracle which is I think it's it's really really good now these blocked account service providers also have a package where they give health insurance and travel insurance including uh, in this blocked account service so um, when you get that package you get the travel insurance for free which is great now everyone does that not like just one service provider but almost everyone is doing the same thing so it is good if you take it like that like you don't have to invest much time for other uh, health insurance research and stuff you don't have to do that but uh, when you choose like a package, then you also have to choose which company, um, wh which health insurance company you have to go uh, forward with. So there are three health insurance companies which are popular among the students and the uh, working employees. That is Technikar Krankenkasse, that is TK, then there is Barmer and lastly it is DAK or DAK, I'm not sure, DAK or DAK, uh, Gesundheit. If you have already done with all these procedures now there is also one thing that you have to do is like doing uh, international payments maybe because of your um, fees or for the accommodation from India so these are the websites where you can do international payments safely and easily so we have Instagram Remitly Viz or wise i'm not sure but yeah so these are a few popular websites where you can do international transactions so lastly for visa you have to go contact to vfs so it depends on your state or your region where which vfs you have to go i went to vfs mumbai because that was the nearest whichever is the nearest vfs you can go do them a visa procedure not the German consulate but the VFS is the one who does all the visa procedures for students for uh, working employees etc so I am done with my list one thing that I would like to mention is that I did not uh, mention any websites for accommodations because accommodation is like a whole different topic which can be like it is a whole detailed topic that I can 
do a video on so i might not do it now but um, i'll i'll try soon making a video on that so a complete information on accommodations in germany and how to find it where to find it and etc some tips everything so that was it from my side i hope this was helpful you can go check the links in the description so that you can save it and use it for the future and um yeah i'll see you in the next video